<clears throat> shalom, shalom. We have the real Hebrew Israelites coming to you week in, week out, prophesying the return of the Most High and His heavenly Son. All praises, honor, glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rachach, Radash. Double honors to the apostles out in New York, Great Millstone, and GMS. Honors to all I can run the planet, lifting up the name of Yahweh, Yahweh Shai, in truth and in sincerity. This is Brother Uriah from Great Millstone, Chicago, is coming to you with another lesson. All right. Um, this is some straight madness, man. Straight madness. This is the reason why all camps must speak the same things. All camps must speak the same things. The scripture says it, man. All right. The Most High is not a, a man that he should lie. And, uh, mm. sorry, just got a message from my boss. So like him. <clears throat> so like it, that threw me off. Um, so yeah, we all camps must teach the same thing. Okay. This matter of fact, let me start off right there. First, uh, let me go get Romans. Because this, this is how cold the most high put in Romans. The last chapter and then 1 Corinthians, the first chapter, which is back to back in the Bible. Just to let you know how serious the Most High is about this. This is Romans, the 16th chapter. And let's see, let me go straight to the point. Verse 17. Now I beseech you, brethren, mark them which cause divisions and offenses contrary to the doctrine which ye have learned, and avoid them. For they that are such serve not our Lord Yahweh Shai Hamashiach, but their own belly, and by good words and fair speeches deceive the hearts of the simple. All right. For your obedience has come abroad unto all men. I'm glad, therefore, on your behalf. But yet I will have you wise unto that which is good and simple concerning evil. All right. So the Lord says, mark anybody who doesn't teach the exact same things that we are teaching. Anything that's contrary to the doctrine. Eating pork is contrary to the doctrine. Celebrating Thanksgiving is contrary to the doctrine. All right? Being on your own and outside of the rule of Yahweh Hashem Shai and the body and the, the, uh, the, the true men of the Lord, you're unruly. And that's the reason why you're teaching abominable things. Okay, and leading people astray. This is First Corinthians, the first chapter, and it says, uh, "Let's see." Uh, so, like it, let me scroll down. Or up. Right, verse ten. Now I beseech you, brethren, by the name of our Lord Yahweh Shai Hamashiach, that ye all speak the same thing, and that there be no divisions among you. But that ye be perfectly joined together in the same mind and in the same judgment. All right? The same mind and in the same judgment. Now, this ain't the mind of the righteous men of the Lord. Shalom, Israel. First, giving all praises to Yahweh by Shiba Mashiach Yahweh Shai. All praises due. These are salutations to the royal house of David. This is what it's all about. I know some of y'all out there. Uh, are cooking and eating and we doing the same thing over here uh, if you have any reservations I just want you to know that, it's, that, it, that it is okay All right. Um, scripture says in uh, Romans chapter 14 that some men esteem one day above the next and some men esteem one day all alike we choose with a conscious choice to make this your homicide day and we do this uh, uh, in remembrance all right, of our son and brother who died for Israel to reunite the northern and southern kingdom. And this is the symbol, all right, that 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 we hold dear and will always hold dear throughout all eternity. Alright. So anybody saying that we're worshiping Thanksgiving or we're uh, uplifting the murder of Native Americans, that's a damn lie. We're not upholding any of that. We're changing the meaning of this day because we are beginning now to destroy the idols out of the land. We have no respect or no love for any fucking Thanksgiving. This is your homicide day. And every day that we celebrate, 
we're going to do this in remembrance of him. All right. So uh, we might as well show you the spread. All right. And uh, if y'all like, you can uh, send me what y'all cooking. We're going to show y'all what we're getting ready to eat on. All right. Shalom. What we got here. We got some roast. Uh, what is that? That's turkey. Turkey. All right, that's the turkey. All right. All right. We got we got yellow corn with bacon, pepper bacon at that, and black pepper. All right. We got fried cabbage. We got uh dirty rice, and over there we got uh cornbread dressing. Coming on around. What's this right here? That is the pork roast. This is cut up pork roast. That's the beef roast. Cut up beef roast. <laughs> and this is uh my world famous. Look at that hair right there. Y'all see that? Y'all see that there? Do y'all see that there? All right. That's that 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 ham. That ham was marinated in Coca Cola for about two straight days. Okay, I'm Got my own private glaze on there. All right. <laughs> The mac and cheese. You wait for that deep enough? The mac and cheese. My boys don't go no deeper. All right. Uh, uh, we got that good mac and cheese going. So, uh, we are now going to what else you got something there? Some gravy. What I have to do. Well, what is it without gravy? Look at that there. Huh? Y'all see how brown that is? Now, you know you want to. Go ahead and show them. Shalom, everybody. Shalom, Mr. Chef. Peace and blessings Chef. to the family. Peace and blessings. All praises. Oh, you want to show the pie? Oh, well, yeah. Ain't we modest? Check them out. Just want to show the pie, too. Look Sweet at that. Sweet potato cheesecake pie. Sweet potato cheesecake pie. What else we got? We got corn fats. We got corn fats. We got corn fats. We got, we got, we got banana. What is that? Banana, banana pudding strawberry, parfait. blueberry, uh, pineapple. What is in there? Banana pudding parfait. Banana pudding parfait. All right. And what else? What else we got? Um, We have a, a carrot cake that's in here and um, a fruit pie. Carrot cake, yeah. And a little Mike's hard lemonade to wash it down. How about that? How about that? And what are you doing? Huh? What are you doing? You just gotta touch something. Huh? Oh, the thing. You have to touch oh shit! Oh shit! And the dab, come on over here. Uh uh, Salah, 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 not the dab. No, 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 I want you to come. That just ain't your name no more. Yeah, now, the dab, this is what you gotta drink with two hands, monkey style. See there? there. He's gonna guard this all night. See? Y'all see that? That's what's called your Halashai Sangria. Alright? So, uh, yes, sir. Uh, that's about it for the day. Uh, these are all of the. Everybody who came out to celebrate with us today. Alright, All praises. All praises. All praises. All praises. Let's have a moment of prayer right now before we start, and then we're going to let y'all go. We're going to lift up the name. Barakatai Yahweh. 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 All right, uh, spin that around for me, smooth man. No, 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 all right, when that trouble comes, we're going to be ready. So you got to hold on tight wherever you at. All right, love y'all. Royal House of David. Uh, the water for uh, pushing that plow and keeping that Luke 9 and 62 uh, 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 always on the forefront. And grabbing that plow and not looking behind you. All right, now, y'all enjoy y'all day because we sure are. Uh, see y'all again on the flip side. KD out. Shalom. Shalom. <clears throat> if you are a like traitor it. or yeah, yeah, you're, you're, and that's funny. Yeah, he's a traitor. All right, 
is a trade tour of how about Shem Yahushai, how about Shem Yahushai, how much Yaki, how about Shem Yahushai, man. That was some straight, 100% madness. Straight madness, man. And the Most High is going to come for those words. All those words. I'm going to run it back, Lord Willard. And we're going to go break this down. Just to show you the mindset of these Johnny Come Lately, these novices, these unruly niggas who refuse to humble down and repent and be under the order of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai and the men above you. The Lord says, give double honors to the elders who rule well. Well, who your elders who let you go around and think it's okay to eat pork? Or that this, that, that, hey, this ain't like bacon, this is the pepper bacon. This is my secret recipe. Oh boy, oh boy. This, this, this shows you the condition of Jake, their mindsets, and how it's so far from the Heavenly Father. Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai Bashim Rakakadai. I'm got a I'm on recording on the Mobizen app, so I'm gonna have to pause here and there because I'm also at the at the gig trying to make some shekels. Oh. All right, so <clears throat> let's just start it from the top. And if anybody who had a spiritual ear, anybody that was in the scriptures. Anybody that was under the righteous order of Yahweh Bashmiel Shai and the righteous men of the Lord, the Lord says, do all things decently and in order. All right, then we, you will see that this is not indicative of men of the Lord. Shalom, Israel. First, giving all praises to Yahweh Bashmiel Shai. All right. So uh, now, once you say that, where did you learn Shalom? Where did you learn Hamashiach? How, where did you learn Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai? So you got groups out there calling on Ahaya Asha, Ahaya. You got groups out there calling on Christ, Most High Christ be blessed. All right? You have people calling on Christ. All right? Then you have people calling on Hamashiach Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. That came from the apostles on down. All right? That came from the apostles. That's who we pushed at. Okay? And schools that came out of the one west. Alright. Now you got other schools that might say how why why you have a shy Hamashiach like ISUPK, but then they'd say you can go do it in the butt. That you can take all kind of stabby wabbies and 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 juicy juicies and um marky warkies. And you can do a whole bunch of other shit there, you know, and they have a whole lot of off doctrine. Okay? But primarily you hear Hamashiach, you how about Shimia Shai, you got it from um, affiliates of Great Millstone on down. Okay? Praise is due. Peace and salutations to the Royal House of David. This is what it's all about. I know some of y'all out there uh, are cooking and eating. And we're doing the same thing over here. Uh, if you haven't any reservations, I just want you to know that, it's, that, it, that it is okay. Alright? Um, Scripture says in uh, Romans chapter 14 that some men esteem one day above the next and some men esteem one day all alike. We choose with a conscious choice to make this Yahweh Shai day. And we do this uh, uh, in remembrance, all right? Of well, see, now, first of all, you can't make a national Yahweh Shai day and then, and then you think the Most High will like his day, Yahweh Shai will like a day devoted to him that it's the same day that so-called Christians, atheists, Muslims, Buddhists, and all kind of wicked motherfuckers create a day of thanksgiving, and they attribute it to their God, their power, but they know the history of it was murder, death, kill. You think the Lord really want a day associated with him that's associated with that bullshit? Who are you to say what day is the Lord a uh, declare a day of Yahweh Shai day? Every day is Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai day. Every single day. And we will not couple a particular day with a so-called holiday and then do a feast just like they do. Just, just like them. That's wicked. Uh, and then you break the scripture down wrong. Uh, uh, you don't take a, 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 a day of the, a holy day of the Lord and decide I'm going to make this, this or that and then take a demonic holiday and then you're going to make this, this and that. Fuck wrong with you? Blending uh, uh, a madness. Don't be unequally yoked 
with unbelievers, man. Unbelievers celebrate Thanksgiving, man. Well, this is your Hawashai's day, and we're going to celebrate it. And we're going to have the turkey, and we're going to have the ham, and we're going to have the same shit. That's no separation. That's no difference, man. If you want to take a day and say, look, man, they them, these wicked are doing your uh, uh, th things kill, killing, we're going we gonna to praise you today. There's nothing wrong with that. We have a special day. We're going to honor you. There's really nothing wrong with that. But if you were going to do that, you do it in righteousness, man. Not in pork. Not in breaking scriptures down wrong. All right? Not in madness. I said, that don't make any sense. This is your Hawashai day. So let's have some pork. Son and brother who died. For son and brother. Our, our son and brother? The Shai is not our son, man. He's the son of the Heavenly Father, man. Now I will give you the Lord. He calls us brothers with him. But the Lord calls him, he said he's the everlasting father. The Prince of Peace. Okay. Now I have a few men of the Lord been blessed to bring in Yahweh Shai. Yes, I'll give you that. All right, over different lifetimes, but uh, he's not collectively our son. He's the son of the heavenly Father, man. Israel to reunite the northern and southern kingdom, and this is the symbol. All right, that 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 we hold dear and will always hold dear throughout all eternity. All right. So anybody saying that we're worshiping Thanksgiving or we're uh, uplifting the murder of Native Americans, that's a damn lie. We're not upholding any of that. We're changing the meaning of this day because we are beginning now to destroy the idols out of the land. We have no respect or no love for any fucking Thanksgiving. This is Yahawashai Day. And every day that we celebrate, we're going to do this in remembrance of him. All right. See, now, if you're doing a remembrance of him eating pork, or you're doing a remembrance of him even associated with uh, things killing, man. And the, the whole thing that you're doing, you say, oh, you ain't doing Thanksgiving. Nigga, your whole spread is Thanksgiving like the Americans, man. Just like these soul food eating, fat, greasy, fat back eating niggas, man. There's a couple who look like that in the goddamn video, too. Well, the fuck out of balance, man. Right. So, uh,. We might as well show you the spread, all right? And uh, Waxing if y'all like, worse. you can uh, send me what y'all cooking. We're going to show y'all what we getting ready to eat on, all right? Shalom, what we got here? We got some roast. Uh, what is that? That's turkey. Turkey? All right, that's the turkey. All right? All right. Simple as we got it. We got yellow corn with bacon. Pepper bacon at that. Hold on. See now, how are you a man of the Lord? And you're gonna say we got turkey, we got corn with, with pepper bacon. Well, what bacon? I mean pepper bacon at that. Proud about the 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 no, this ain't regular going to fuck off ass bacon. It's pepper bacon. Like the pepper make it clean. Like the pepper made it lawful. It's cool now because it's pepper bacon. Oh my god. No, I don't think I should have to bring out this precept, but obviously we do, because some nigglets and niggerettas in, uh, you know, calling themselves Israel, have forgotten um, the law, have forgotten the commandments, have forgotten the spirit of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, Leviticus 11 and 7, man, and the swine, hold on, let me go up, look. Verse 4 of Leviticus 11 and 4. Nevertheless, these shall ye not eat of them that chew the cud, or of them that divide the hoof as the camel, because he cheweth the cud, but divideth not the hoof. He is unclean unto you. I'm jumping down to the point. Verse 7. And the swine, the pig, the pork, all right? Uh, uh, and the swine. He, though he divide the hoof and be cloven footed, yet he chew not the cud. He don't eat grass. He is unclean to you. All right. Of their flesh shall ye not eat, and their carcass ye shall not touch. 
they are unclean to you. All right? He said we don't supposed to touch their carcass and we don't supposed to, to eat nothing of the swine. Nothing. Period. That's scripture. How are you calling Hamashiach trying to say that you're Israelite and now you're lumping yourself. Now if I'm teaching someone that we're Israelites and they happen to stumble across your video and they're not vetted yet. They see that, oh, I can still eat pork, but wait a minute, he said we can't eat pork, wait a minute, it's madness, it's confusion. And black pepper, all right, we got fried cabbage, we got uh, dirty rice, and over there we got uh, cornbread dressing. Coming on around, what's this right here? That is the pork rice. This is cut up pork roast. Cut up That's pork roast. roast. Cut up beef roast. <laughs> and this is uh, my world famous. Look at that hat right there. Y'all see that? Y'all see that there? Do y'all see that there? All right. That's that, 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 that ham. That ham was marinated in Coca-Cola. Oh, yeah, oh, hold on. Hold on. Now, I can hear Pasta Tahar. Brothers, you still drinking that pop, that soda? Yes, what's wrong with you? Y'all crazy. You want to just drink some poison? Just drink, drink some death. Just go, just kill yourself. The fuck you drinking all that bullshit pop? You do you know high fructose high fructose corn syrup is one of the leading causes of cancer, diabetes, gout, and, and high blood pressure and every other goddamn nigga disease that Deuteronomy 28 said you are gonna get for trusting in this goddamn wicked place and going away from the law, statute, commandments of the heavenly Father. And so you already took the pork which we don't supposed to eat. Okay. A pork, a pig is, is a, a, a clean animal. As long as it's cleaning up the, the ground and the, and the forests and, and the farms as it was designed to do. As soon as you sit over there and put corn in it, eating it, you just made it unclean for you. And abominable. But then you're going to put an abominable Coca-Cola on it? And then you grow up on this as a Hamashiach day? He that touches pitch uh, uh, is defiled therewith. You're dirty, nigga. And you're gonna call and plug this into your house, Bashim Yahushai? The most high coming for you, boy, unless you repent, man. You need to take this video down, you need to repent, and you need to put yourself under the spirit of the man of the Lord. Because you gotta relearn some shit for you to come out and think this shit is cool. And I don't think you're gonna do it, because I think you're proud. Don't die yet. Don't think that we're doing this just like Thanksgiving and that we, bro, we ain't condoning. No, we just made this your Howard Shy Day. But Lord says, if you love me, keep my commandments. That's what the scriptures say. If you love me, keep my commandments. And the commandments say, do not eat swine. I just read it. If you don't follow the commandments, you don't love you. How about you, Howard Shy? That's period. Two straight days. Okay, I'm Got my whole private glaze on there. <laughs> and he and this is a joke to him. This is a, this is this is fun to him. <laughs> Mac and cheese, my fave looking ass. Make me miss my turn. Got me frustrated in this motherfucker, man. Seriously, man. Now go do a U-turn. Shit. The mac and cheese. You wait, will that deep enough? The mac and cheese. My boys don't go no deeper. All right. Uh, uh, we got that good mac and cheese going. So, uh, we are now. What the? What else you got? Something. Yes, I'm gravy. What I have to. Well, what is it without gravy? Look at that there. Huh? Y'all see how brown that is? Now, we know you want to. Go ahead and show them. Shalom, everybody. Shalom, Mr. Chef. To the family. Peace and blessings. You got your woman all out there, man. When have you seen the apostles, the elders, the men of the Lord, put the women all out there on camera and on? But the scripture says, "Let the, 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 the let the women keep silence in the churches, man." She shouldn't be even seen. Why the hell are you putting your woman out there on blast, man? That's some dysfunctional ass, goddamn it, just off ass nigga shit. Got your women, your your woman out there, and and put her all on on a hundred percent blast. 
this right here, this is this is this shit is ridiculous. I don't gotta do some work. All praises. Oh, you want to show a pause? Oh, well, yeah. Ain't we modest? Check them out. Just want to show the pause to look at that. Uh, ain't modest my ass. That's proud as hell. Pride becomes before destruction and a fall. All right? And this, the Lord is obviously putting you on blast. Now, another brother, uh, the brother Yardan from our camp, said that uh, he also calls and believes that he's King David. This madness. Now, I hadn't seen that, so I got to look at that first. But this is madness. Madness, straight madness. Sweet uh, potato cheesecake pie. What else we got? We got corn fats. We got corn fats. We got corn fats. We got. See, and, and he thinks this is a joke. Turkey day. Mac and cheese. Love it, mac and cheese. Hey, y'all, parfait. <laughs> Parfaits, but parfait. This is a joke to him, man. Do you know that we're fighting for our lives? We're fighting for our salvation. We're fighting for our souls. We're fighting for deliverance. The Lord said, "Be blessed is he who he when he returns he finds so doing." What you doing right there is going against the laws, statutes, commandments of, the, of Yahweh, Bashimi, Yahweh, Shai, Bashim, Rakakadash. He's not cool with that, man. He's not cool with that at all. And then you sit him there uh, uh, um, glorifying pork, pepper, bacon, Yahweh, Shai day. Man, that's shit. This shit crazy. Banana, what is that? Banana, banana pudding, parfait. Blueberry, uh, pineapple. What is that? Banana pudding, parfait. Banana pudding, parfait. All right. And what else? What else we got? Um, we have a, a carrot cake. Oh, yeah. That's in here as well. Um, a fruit pie. Fruit pie. Carrot cake, yeah. And a little Mike's hard lemonade to wash it down. How about that? How about that? And what are you doing? Huh? What are you doing? Excuse me. Mm -hmm. that's, that's another thing. Now you're, you're sacrificing these little children to Molech, man. You're, you're sacrificing these uh, um, children to the fire, as the scriptures say, all right? You're bringing them children right to the fucking fire because you know what she was eating? The same thing y'all was eating, all right? You're, 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 you're teaching them wrong and leading them up wrong, man. And the Most High, you think the Most High is not going to come back for those words and come back for that? Oh, forget about the thing, yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Now, the dab, come on over here. Uh, uh, salah, salah, salah. Not the dab. No, 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 no. I want you to come. That just ain't your name no more. <laughs> yeah. Now, the dab, this is what he got to drink with two hands, monkey style. See that? Yeah. He going to guard this all night. See? Y'all see that? That's what's called your hollow shy sangria. All right? So, uh, yes, sir. Uh, that's about it for the day. Uh, these are all of the, everybody who came out to celebrate with us today. All right, so wow, wow, all praises, all praises, all praises. All praises. All praises. All praises. Uh, let's have a... See, they got the women and men mingled and mixed together. All right, that's off. That causes confusion. And trust me, that leads to confusion. Before we got, you know, fully under the tutelage of the elders and we were, you know, uh, starting on our own and we was going through the hard knocks uh, of GMS Chicago Southwest before we merged with GMS Chicago Mapataza Amaf, which, you know, right now we're at one united camp. Uh, we tried teaching with the sisters and, and add, you know, the sisters, you know, the brothers and their wives and, and trying to have, you know, have things in order. That shit got sloppy and messy and we quickly, I mean, it was quick. It was like, oh no, hell no. That, 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 no, no, women separate. Women stay separate from the men. Why you see that throughout throughout the scriptures? Now, if you, someone is hosting and, and you know a, a something, and they got the wife there. That's one thing. But even then, she comes in and dips in, brings food, whatever, and get the fuck up out of there. And she's quiet. That's why the women, the Most High, tells the women to keep their foot when it comes to the congregation of the Most High. You don't have men and women mingled together. That's not wise at all. But see, their leadership is unruly. He's not. He's without rule. So he's doing what the fuck he think is cool, what what is all right in his eyes and his mind, not in the side of Yahweh Ba Shimi Yahweh Shai Ba Shamr Chakradash. All right. Moment of prayer right now before we start, and then we gonna let y'all go. We gonna lift up the name. Barakatha Yahweh. Barakatha Yahweh. Barakatha Yahweh. Barakatha Yahweh. 
And then you think he's going to feast with you? He says, Behold, I stand at the door and knock. He that hears my voice and open up the door, I will open. Uh, I will come in and sup with him and he with me. You really think that the Haobashim Yawashai about to come sup with you all while you're sitting over there eating goddamn pork? Uh, spin that around for me, smooth man. Oh, wait, right. so, wait, 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 wait. On the other side of captivity, we're going to be eating pork, honey baked ham, pepper baked steaking, bacon, whatever the fuck that shit was. That shit is abominable. The Most High is pissed at that shit. And you think this, you're holy and righteous? That's why the scripture says many are fooled by their own vain opinion. The Lord said he'll give a strong delusion that they can believe a lie. They believe a lie. And they're pushing madness. And then you're teaching others that but if the blind follow the blind, they all gonna fall into the motherfucking ditch, man. We gonna be ready. So y'all hold on tight wherever you at. Alright? Love y'all. Royal House of David. Uh the water for uh pushing that plow and keeping that loop nine and sixty-two uh, uh uh always on the forefront and grabbing that plow and not looking behind you. Alright? Now, y'all enjoy y'all day, cause we show sure are. Uh see y'all again on the flip side. KD out. Show on. All right. Hello, everybody. Uh, Anton here from. So that I mean, that's it, man. You got uh, these little nigglets out here waxing worse and worse. And if they are really true, sincere men, they're gonna have to repent. They need to take that wicked ass video down, and they need to humble down. Right? We all have to teach the same thing. We all have to be on the same one accord. The scriptures talk about being on one accord. You cannot be out here doing your own solo dolo. Scripture says no man liveth unto himself, man. You have to be under the righteous rulership of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. He set up apostles, he set up elders and bishops and ordained them. You have to be ordained through the power of the Lord, not of your goddamn self. So now I'm gonna go scrutinize these motherfuckers and go see if they're calling themselves David. Now, the apostles and elders, I wasn't around with them. But I give them credence because everything that they have showed to the spirit and power of Yahweh Shai has been on point. All right, for not for one year, not for five years, not for ten years, not for fifteen years, not for twenty years. All right, not for uh, uh thirty years, but thirty-five plus years. All right, starting with the Apostle Tahar on down. Okay. So. If that's, if that's what the spirit of the Heavenly Father has and has got it set to, then you follow the leadership from, of those men of, of, the, of the Lord before us, man. And they believe that King Mashah was King David. I, have to, I cannot dispute them. I can't refute them. I have to give that credence to them because I'm following underneath them and they have not taught me anything wrong. Okay? And anything that was so-called wrong, they fixed and tweaked it and, and, and corrected it. So, I don't know what the hell this guy is on. I don't know who he think he is. But I know one thing. He ain't acting like a man of the Lord. Have it as, um, creating a Hawashai day on Thanksgiving. And then having a Thanksgiving feast. With, 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 with uh, corn. With pepper bake, bacon. And, and honey baked ham. And roast pig and roast swine. Most High got a vendetta for the wicked, man. The Most High has a vendetta for the wicked. So if you're not following your Yahweh Shem Yahushai by Shem Rakhakadash, the Most High is going to destroy you. And it's as simple as that. Hopefully this has been edifying through the spirit and power of Yahweh Shem Yahushai by Shem Rakhakadash. Don't unsubscribe to these niggas. Stop following these guys and uh, stick to the men of the Lord with the righteous doctrine and the righteous spirit and the righteous works, man. Shalom and the Badba Ball to the two niggas like that.
niggas who want to be the stupid, want to follow uh, the pernicious ways of the wicked and the heathen, man. Fucking pork like that shit is cool. Call me Asherala.